one. Today I want to talk about an indie game I played recently, and thankfully it's turned out to be a pleasant surprise. I believe it's exclusive to the PlayStation, and it's free for PS Plus members as of right now. I believe it came out a week or two ago, and what I'm referring to is, of course, the fun little game known as Rocket League. Essentially, the whole purpose of this game is a football match. You have one versus one, up to four versus four, and each player takes control of a remote control car. And the cool thing with this is that it's... It's such a small game, it could have flown past the radar, but since it came out free on PS Plus, people decided to download it and check it out. And it's an extremely fun game. It's simple in its premise, and there's not much to it, but what's there is really fun. And it's a nice detraction from the big AAA games we've gotten recently, which are great, mind you, but sometimes it's nice to kick back and just play a fun game to relax. And this is an extremely fun game. Basically, it's simple. You have a set of cars on each side, and controlled by humans preferably, there could be AI as well, but preferably to have the most fun match, have all humans, and the goal is two big goals on either side, and your job, simple, just score on the other team's goal, it's like a football match, and basically why the cars, all they can do is turbo and jump, there's no superpowers in this game, you just ride around trying to hit the bonds in their net, and see, it's simple, but it, the carnage is crazy. There's some funny moments in this game. Like, I remember I, when I played it, there was one moment where I was going for the ball, but I was never going to make it before the defender got it. Then my friend decided to ram up behind me using turbo and literally fling me into the ball, which I flung into the net. There's so many crazy scenarios that can happen in this game. Just the time, if you were, like, there could be a moment where, like, four people could crash into each other at once, and that could send up the ball going, flying off the ceiling, and all over every wall of the arena, and it's just, it's just chaos. There's no skill to this game. You can defend up little tactics here and there, but mostly it's just, it's made for a fun time, but it's not made to be taken serious. The other cool aspect about this game well, is that there's so much customization in it. You keep on locking all these nice little lockables, do you know, remember when we actually unlock stuff in games instead of paying for them? Such as new wheels, new paint jobs, new hats. For some reason you can put hats in your cars. It, it sounds stupid, but it's funny to see. My personal favourite is the Fez. Matt Smith Doctor Who reference. And, and you can unlock flags as well. And it, the small little things, well, it's nice little uh, options to your customization. And you all seem to unlock some new after every match. That's how I see it anyway. And... That's my way to the game. It's that's all there is to it. That's all there needs to be to it. It's a simple game that's fun as hell. And I hope more people check it out. And if this is successful, I'd like to see these developers maybe add more stuff to the Rock League. Maybe game more specifically where there is poor rocks. Because I can just imagine how crazy that would be. And of course, the fun thing I'll say before I end this review is the graphics, which is a weird thing to say about a small indie game. But this is running on Unreal Engine Four, and you can tell. It looks amazing. There's that old joke in FIFA games where the grass is greener. Look at that grass. It looks amazing. But in Rocket League, you look at the grass and it looks actually good. It's such a stupid thing to say. Well, if I rewatch this video after the check, I'll probably cringe because I hear myself saying, look at the grass. But Rocket League, seriously, look at this grass. It is really good looking. And just in, in the cars, everything looks so shiny, which is probably why it looks so good but you can tell that from this small game that the Unreal Engine 4 has some serious power behind it well that's all I need to say Rocket League is definitely a game you have to check out and it's just a blast to play whether it's you're against playing with your friends or you're by yourself check it out it is so much fun you will not regret it and if you're a PS Plus member it's free so you have no reason thank you for listening and I'll see you next time